Yo, so what is up guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video was a leg out update, so let's get into it. As we're heading down the steps to the train room, we enter into what is always a nice layout to me. So man, a lot of things have changed. Um, so on this layout, the only thing that hasn't changed is I don't know if I remember if it was in my last one, but I'm going to point it out, is the fact that we have a train station there now. And that's new on this side. Um, the major differences on this side are this bridge, this Pennsylvania PRR bridge on there. It's a really nice bridge. Um, back here is the same. That's different. Right under the bridge. A lot of changes right where that bridge is. Um, this we kind of worked on a little bit. I kind of put another coat to darken some spots up. And not nothing has changed on the train station area at this moment um this is one of my bnsf cars that i've had for a while now and i decided to bring it over here it's been sitting on my other layout not moving so i thought maybe it's time to bring it over so it's running behind my csx unfortunately i don't have any bnsf locomotives um one of the biggest changes is the fact that now I have mountains right after the wall coming down to there and let me move that and I've started filling in mountains on this side so it's right there and it's the same way I did the this but it's mountains and then I ended up so it would match the inside. That is now mountains instead of a wall. And there are these. As you can see, there's wires coming out. We actually put a insulated piece of track right back there. And these are all running off of it. The only thing is uh, that has to be replaced. It is not working anymore. Um, I have an extra one that works, so I will probably be over there to pick that up tonight. And the problem I was having was there was a lot of wires underneath just dangling. And I actually went and found some of these Christmas light clips that we had uh, that were broken and they're just all under the layout attached to some screws that come through a little bit like this they're attached to that and then there's a little hook that i run them through and it just gets it gets it so i one i can vacuum underneath the layout and as you can see they are temporarily off the ground but it's definitely nicer than walking down here and seeing a whole bunch of just wires sticking down. Um, something that is different in here is I just need to wire it up and the test layout works for many of you guys. Here's uh, my project that we're trying to get fixed right now. And here is my collection as of right now. In the front, I have my mom's Eagles train. It's made by MTH. Then my mom's old Santa Fe. Then a Santa, another Santa Fe. Then most of it's steam. There's only a couple out of this that need fixed. Um... This one needs fixed. That's the turbine. That was my sister's. 
Um, I just recently fixed this. The tender clip actually broke off, but we were able to fix that. That we are trying to get fixed, and that's really it, other than the a problem that we're having with the switch on the 2020. That's really it. Um, I am slowly working on Thomas. He, sadly, when I was young, um, one of my mom's friend's kids ended up breaking it. And ever since then, I have not been able to find any parts to fix him. But I am slowly making parts to fix him. Like, this is... I built that just out of some plastic I had sitting around. Um, yeah, so that is a quick review um, that I thought you guys would be interested in on the layout. Um, so, yeah. And one more thing I forgot to show you guys is this poster. I actually made this in um, class. Uh, it was a Photoshop class in ninth grade. I have two. I made one for me and my grandfather. This is his, obviously. But I it was a Photoshop class, and I just went and grabbed a bunch of Lionel pictures. And this, actually, I put in the middle because I actually have that sign. And then you have the 2020, the 911, the big boy, and... Polar Express, the famous Hudson, GG1, and a lot more others. So, that is all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And in the end of the video, I will put a small, probably like 12, maybe 24 second video of the all this working. So, I hope you guys enjoyed.